Hey everybody, Alex Terrace here, healthpacksreviewed.com. So this video is going to be on a different supplement formulation or protocol, I should say, for how you would increase uh, natural hormone uh, levels of the endocrine system, but also uh, regulate and balance those different systems. And this is mainly done through an herbal approach. Uh, there are some minerals as well. Uh, but this is essentially an alternative for those who are looking at alternatives for um, hormone replacement. Um, and this is just kind of some of the basics, I would say. Um, this, form, this kind of protocol can get a lot more complex. But so the first one here is maca. Uh, this is an herb uh, from the Andes. It's a tuber. So this has um, gotten a lot of attention in the last 10 years, I would say, in the health field. But just simply Google um, about everything that maca is capable of doing. But it's a way, it's a food essentially that is able to increase output um, and also regulate over time the longer you take it. So like six months, 12 months has a balancing effect. So this is great even for women uh, pre-menopause and post-menopause um, and for men andropause. It's really just pretty much good for everybody. Um, and so then it's a question of which brand is good. And there's many different macas. Some is raw, some is gelatinized. That means cooked essentially, which is the appropriate way that they do it in Peru in the Andes. But you can also get an extract, which I've found to be even, uh, you know, the superior approach. So this brand is really great right here that you can find on Amazon. So. For that price point, it's actually really good uh, savings because you're getting a much stronger extract, a much stronger effect. You don't have to take the same amount of quantity. And if you actually compare it to how much it takes to make an extract, it's actually a very good savings. So I like this one here. Then moving on, uh, this right here is from an herbal line, Dragon Herbs. Uh, Ron T. Garden is a pretty well world renowned herbalist that has a very good supplement line. And all of his formulations, honestly, are really fantastic. And his standards of extraction, just ethically harvested, everything is just, you know, very good for, for the price, especially. So this one is just one cap is all you take. Uh, this is generally something that tends to work better for men. Uh, and as you can see, here's the extraction. So it's a very extremely potent extraction. Uh, dry crystallized extract and is is a very is something that you'd basically just want to get on the re website and look into but their extraction methods are um, usually they've pioneered the way I should just say in terms of extraction methods and their way of an analyzing what active constituents are in their formulations in here long jack root it's probably one of the best ways to increase testosterone naturally and that can even release uh, luteinizing hormone, so free testosterone, and there's no upper limit they've found. So you don't necessarily have to cycle it, although some people cycle, I mean, they take it for four weeks, go off of it, or take five weeks, go off for two weeks. Uh, but you can continue to do that, and I've found, other people have found that that still tends to make it work more effectively. Uh, but it's something that is one of the most powerful natural herbs uh, for raising uh, testosterone, but it does provide other health benefits as well related to vitality. Um, this is actual ants. They found that in the herb, uh, in, going back a few thousand years in Chinese, Arabic, Greek medicine, herbal medicine, that actually the ant and the compounds in ants are one of the more powerful, um, have some of the more powerful constituents basically for a wide variety of conditions that are related to vitality. Uh, and this is another one you can read on as well, basically. But either way, I'm pointing this formulation out more because of the long jack in it. And it is actually very hard to find a quality herb uh, of this particular species. There's maybe only one or two other options out of many uh, that's properly done and honestly doesn't have toxic residues and things like that. A lot of it comes from Malaysia and it's just, they don't have proper third party tests. The extraction isn't good there's a lot of things that can happen with this particular herb so it's not easy to get your hands on uh, this is a formula within your first week of taking it second week it's very noticeable um, the improvement of energy motivation uh, all kinds of different things so this one is a surefire guarantee so 
yeah, you know, that's the price and some people would find that expensive, but remember you're only doing one cap a day and you have a total of 100 days worth. So considering the quality of the product, it's, uh, that's actually really, really cheap. Um, it's a very affordable uh, herb formula right there. Uh, and again, just take it, you'll see for yourself. You probably never wanna get off of it. So that's for that one, moving on. Uh, for generalized energy and immune system, uh, cordyceps is a medicinal mushroom. There's several medicinal mushrooms. Some of the most uh, researched herbs uh, in the world would be medicinal mushrooms, they're called. So there's different ones. There's reishi, you may have heard about reishi, for example. Uh, that's another common one. Cordyceps is a very common one internationally, uh, very much sought after because it has such a youthing effect. So it gives you all kinds of energy. There's many different ways it does that. There's almost too much to explain, so just Google about it. Um, and there's just a ton of research studies, thousands at this point. So this is something that's good for anybody experiencing a lot of fatigue, uh, and that could be related to other issues, not necessarily hormones, um, but this does have a nice effect also on the endocrine system. Uh, so this is another powerhouse for individuals that just have a busy lifestyle. But also remember that when you have a busy lifestyle or you're pushing the body a lot in athletic uh, types of ways, that can also depress the immune system. So cordyceps has tons of immune modulating effects. Uh, in fact, there's a huge amount of studies on this with serious diseases, especially cancer. Uh, so, and the reason, by the way, for cancer, why they're doing a lot of research and why it's like one of the main therapies in Japan is because it re is releasing molecular oxygen on a singlet level, which, which along with some other factors in this, will actually cause apoptosis and mess with the RNA replication or synthesis of cancerous cells. So there's a lot on this, and this brand in particular makes some of the best. So they actually do lab control grown, but they're the only ones, they say right here, grown under low temperature and low oxygen. No other company does that, period. So in terms of you know, harvesting out in nature is one option, it's more expensive for that kind of product, and they've actually found that uh, tweaking the temperature and oxygen conditions, they can actually, over time, they've learned to make their cordyceps more potent and consistent at bottle to bottle than just getting some wild cordyceps out in nature. And the price point is excellent uh, for what it is. And yeah, so check that out. Moving on here to one of the other main causes of low hormonal levels and high actually, so just imbalances, is what we see in, it's younger now nowadays, but probably 35, 45, 50s, 40s, past the age of 40, and just basically the older you get, is it's common to see in both men and women, a dominance and estrogen, estrogen dominance, dominance or estrogenic dominance. <clears throat> Many reasons for that. Some are environmental pollutants that are xenoestrogens that mimic est natural estrogen in your body. That's one reason. Uh, another common reason is just simply your liver, the health of your liver. And that's one of the more common reasons uh, for having uh, low levels of DHEA. And you can again, Google that. I'll put that in the description below. You can look that up. Low DHEA or high estrogen, low testosterone, uh, low progesterone if you're a woman. So Myomin is some is actual formulation, Chinese formulation that's well known and also has several clinical studies on it. And you just take it for a cycle of three to six months. It just depends on your needs, but on average three to four months of taking this, and then you're done. Your body should, your liver should be back on track at that some at that point. This also purges the body of those xenoestrogenic uh, compounds, which uh, one of the main ways you're getting that is from different things in fertilizers, antibiotics, and also plasticides. Plasticides have made their way in a lot of different things. So this works extremely well, uh, and you should be able to actually track those hormonal levels on a general saliva hormonal panel to see the change. So generally when you lower estrogen, your testosterone will rise, or your progesterone will, will rise if you're a woman. And that just naturally happens. Plus your liver health improves, and when you improve the health of your liver, then you improve the health literally of every single aspect to your health, from brain and mental to mood, you name it. Your digestion improves. So powerful formula, you don't have to take it forever. You just have to do a protocol of a few months. 
some people find their next year and a year after that, sometimes they'll need to do like a bottle to top themselves up again and stay optimal. It just depends, but you never have to do that full on protocol, usually more than once. Uh, so it's a little expensive to do it for some people. But remember, again, you're just running that full cycle one time for the most part, which is, which is a great deal considering what it can do and how it can get your liver back on track. So let's move on here to the next one. So you always want to address minerals and trace minerals. And that's what allows your genetics to actually work, epigenetics, and also allows your vitamins to actually work. So most people are deficient in minerals for many reasons. And there are several uh, water-soluble minerals that people are more deficient in, and zinc is one of those. Zinc, if you just Google the importance of zinc, it's crucially important. So zinc affects your health in a lot of different ways, uh, especially digestive issues um, and especially hormonal issues. So this is something also especially more important for men. So if you're a man watching this, you'll, you'll naturally get your testosterone actually way up from where it is just by simply supplementing with zinc. And there's a special time of the day. It's actually right before bed. So if you take it on an empty stomach, you might get an upset stomach for a little bit. So you might take it with a small snack, maybe, uh, yeah, just whatever is your choice. Something very small, just have a little something. And or you could also take it for sure, for sure with dinner time and still get a really good effect when you go to bed. And also, the other thing that people have a weakening immune system, especially as they get older, it's called immune senescence. And that's caused by a few different things. But one common reason is simply zinc deficiency. Uh, and then if you really want to boost your immune system, by the way, this company, Life Extension, which is pretty well known, they do a zinc lozenge. Zinc acetate is the form in that lozenge. That was specifically suppressed by the FDA. You can read the whole story because it was supposed to come out some decades ago, but it was specifically suppressed. And uh, partly because they found that the zinc acetate got the thymus gland to help fend off some serious disease and conditions like reversing childhood leukemia. Yeah. So you can start to see how controversial that was. Uh, zinc acetate is a surefire way to prevent yourself from getting sick or to get over an illness very quickly. And it's a lozenge. Uh, so you can always take that form. It's up to you if you want to do that. It's a great form to supplement with all the time. But normally, for the first month or two, most people are so deficient, they're going to need this amount of potency. And they put in several forms here, several chelations. Monomethionine is a great form for the liver to really utilize this. Zinc citrate, always a great chelation or chelation. Uh, so, and then for the value, it's they've come down way in price on this really cheap for the amount you get in there. It's a huge amount of servings. So that one would do great things for you. You really feel that. Moving on here. The other cause of having lower hormonal levels is, um, and I didn't get into the fats on this, uh, and I will in a second, is a deficiency in certain essential fatty acids and then also deficiency in amino acids. Now, people can be deficient in protein and be eating lots of protein. Like I've seen athletes and they're eating a ton of protein, more than you probably, unless you're an athlete watching this. Uh, and or somebody who likes to work out a lot or something like that. But they can be eating a ton of protein and still be amino acid deficient. It's absolutely possible. And that's many times due to a, a inability or deficiency of not being able to assimilate uh, what you're getting. So it's not how much the quantity, but also the assimilation, how much you're taking into the body. This is the only protein that has 99% assimilation. So most proteins uh, from food or other supplements are at least half the assimilation of this or a quarter or just somewhere in between. So this one I actually am selling for 25 bucks, so a lot less if anybody's interested in some bottles. But uh, this one I like because it's also no calories, so you can take it also in the evening time and not upset your sleep quality. And a great time to raise your hormone levels is taking essential amino acids right before bed because your body will take that, uh, some of these core uh, amino acids and actually you'll be able to produce a higher amount of growth hormone during the first sleep cycle, which is when normally the growth hormone rises. So that's a great raw material and amino acids are crucial for so many other things, proper liver support, 
and proper neurotransmitter synthesis. So a lot of people will find they're actually deficient in their neurotransmitter levels, which is affecting them in a lot of different ways. Their liver's not detoxifying properly. A lot of this just actually is not assimilating amino acids properly. So this product is really good for a lot of different things. It also keeps you very satiated because it's so assimilable. So you could cut your calories 500 if you're trying to do weight loss and still feel satisfied. Your body won't feel like it's craving more food. So anyways, fantastic product. Um, and then for a really good like essential um, fatty acid product, I like uh, Perfect Press Seed Oils Active. I think it's activated or active. This one just gives you a really full spectrum. You see this one here, the five seed oil blend. They have a way that's actually better than even cold pressing their oils. Normally when you get oils or fats or fish oils, they're always rancid is the bottom line. And rancid oxidated fats are some of the worst thing you can possibly put into your body. So uh, this company does the best in terms of pressing their seeds. So all of these can be good for you. They can also be bad for you if they're rancid form or oxidized. And again, most of them are oxidized. If you're consuming any of these right now, it's probably oxidized. So uh, switch over to this brand, it's really good. It gives you all your kind of essential fatty acids you would need. And this helps with so many different things. Again, too much to talk about as far as what your body manufactures out of essential fats. But they call them essential, just like essential uh, amino acids because your body cannot go without them. It can't manufacture them also themselves. You need to get it from your diet. So. You know, it's not, you don't have to have a million supplements. Uh, you know, you can cover your essential fats, which is awesome, all in one shot with this. You can come cover all your essential amino acids with the other product. Uh, and then if anybody has any questions for like macro minerals and then for trace minerals, uh, I also know the best products for those too. And this is just kind of like looking at supplements for the last few thousand hours or the last uh, 10, 15 years. So that's it for this. Uh, and this also is something you need to look into if your horm uh, hormone levels are also low or out of balance. That's the other common reason why people are low is they're not actually getting some of the raw essential fatty acids, which again are the building blocks of different types of hormone metabolites, hormone uh, groups. So again, one product and then you can just say, great, I got that covered. Um, and now I don't have to worry about trying to eat the right foods you know, to try to get these essential amino acids or essential amino acids or essential fatty acids. Uh, and that's pretty much it for this video. If you have any questions um, as far as what was covered in this, just feel free to leave your questions below. And you can also find me for a free consultation on healthhacksreview.com where I research all kinds of different equipment. Um, and these are these supplements. I don't get into supplements very much, but this is some of the stuff I'll usually provide in my consultation when people are asking me about different healing technologies like devices and equipment. But I'm always kind of providing a lot of added value even beyond the technologies based on other research I've done. So don't, don't hesitate to reach out. And thanks for watching.